Today we're reviewing the Swivel Sweeper Max. I picked this up for $30 at my local Big Lots. I believe you can get it for $30 on Amazon. And if you find it somewhere, um, like a drugstore that sells I've seen on TV products, they're selling them for $40. Um, the big deal about the new model, the Swivel Sweeper Max version, is the fact that it has a much stronger motor and you can easily remove the uh, the brushes to get hair out of it and stuff like that um, battery supposed to last longer and um, I don't know it's supposed to do a pretty decent job from what I've read but I'm gonna go ahead and put it to the test and we'll see what happens so let's just let's run a few tests a few real-life scenarios and see what happens okay test one is going to be I'm gonna put some baby powder on a, uh, a hardwood laminate floor. And let's see how well it picks that up. I, I, I use a lot of baby powder, especially in the morning, um, or body powder, I mean. I put it in my shoes because my feet really stink, and I also put it in my jock and uh, butt area because uh, it's really hot out here in New Orleans, and I just get to chafing so bad. So let's say I was in a rush to get ready. I got dressed downstairs, and oops, oh no powder all over the ground right okay let's see what happens one thing I don't like is that you have to reach way down here to turn the power switch on I wish it was up at the top on the handle so we're gonna turn it on it's a little bit noisy a little noisier than I thought it would be let's see how it does we'll give it a couple passes A few passes. Some more passes. It, it is picking it up though. The powder is almost gone. I think it's going to leave a slight, slight film on the ground. But not too bad. I would say 3 out of 5 stars on a uh, body powder pickup. Let's try something Okay, the else. next test is going to be, and this one is definitely applicable to uh, what happens around my house. I'm always eating popcorn. And let's see when we sprinkle a little bit of popcorn, not only on the middle of the floor. Okay, let's next go ahead we're and gonna try the swivel sweep on the steps. The steps are probably the most annoying thing for me to clean in the house because the vacuum cleaner's too big for it. And the little dust buster type deal thing that I have really just doesn't work at all. So let's say I come home straight, just stumbling drunk, and I need to get upstairs and get in bed, and maybe I happen to have a handful of rice for whatever reason. And, oops, I drop all this uncooked rice on the steps. Let's go ahead and see if our Swivel Sweep Max can do the job. And this is a... Uh, it's a pretty thick carpet here, so let's see. All right, it, surprisingly, it's strong enough to muscle through. It sounds like it's picking up the uh, the uncooked rice. I'm gonna stop it in a second here, and we'll go over it. See if it works. Wow, it did a really, really good job. Test, we're gonna use some of that uncooked rice in the kitchen, and I'm just gonna sprinkle some on the ground. Seems like this would be a common thing to have to pick up. Let's see how the swivel sweep does. That's a great success. Overall, I would have to give the Swivel Sweeper Max two thumbs up. Thank you for watching. This is Ryan from SillyReviews.com.
Thank <laughs> you.